Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Last time so today's video is again on a requested video. So today's video is going to be on how I edit my reels. Like I'm gonna do basically on reels. I will be doing one on my videos really really soon, like my YouTube vlogs and all that. But today I'm just going to do uh, in one of my reels as I'm about to like do a transition edit. So I just thought that maybe I should bring you guys along with me. Like it's quite like basically a simple one but still i wanted to bring you guys with me so first of all i have done the transition part yesterday because uh in that dance video which i did like i have just shoot her that reel on that and just have to make that one without the makeup one this is like a gojo shirt which i just found randomly because i was not able to find anything you know just grab that one and just so one thing just ignore the fact that i have like this thing for the transition i don't know why but yesterday as i was getting ready and after i completed like filming the dance i just thought that i should make a transition as well but then i wasn't able to get a single like uh like what you will say a cloth to just do the transition part and i just saw that this i think this is basically for that ravinder shangeet like you use it and i just found it lying there and i just thought that maybe i just i should just use it and i just went ahead and just did this one so now i'm just going to go ahead and shoot that part because i haven't so let's just shoot that part and after that i'm just going to show you how i edit my reels so guys just ignore this book i just got it just for the stand and i have that reel so here is this reel so i'm just gonna what i do is i just crop it like that and here i am so i'm just gonna do and flim this part like that let's do it and then just i just go ahead and delete this part because instagram doesn't allow us to delete a part that you have already created so then you just gotta go ahead and delete this part as well and then yeah, good to go now you can just go ahead and film that video so i'm just gonna zoom it and just place it where i want that portion to be and that will be good to go queen recording this part as well i don't know if i can shoot while doing that so i'm here here i have the reel i'm just gonna make the sound a bit loud i'm gonna zoom it in and just check the frame alignment and i just do this one without any filter so I'm just gonna go ahead and grab this thing which I don't know why I just picked it up randomly so so here I have like I just set the timer for three seconds and then here is that the clothes I don't know for what reason I just picked it up so do like that oh it's literally my hair i think it turned out quite good i think i should just do it once more because i didn't like it okay i think i just zoomed it too much so i'm just gonna do this one okay so here's the cloth okay so right now I'm just gonna zoom it a bit and then just gonna keep it like that and then okay now I'm good. Okay. Yeah, that is quite good. So then here I have just I just use this we have like this filter when you swipe it I just use the Paris one and just save it okay then so guys now I'm done so now what I gotta do is I just go ahead and use VN for the editing purpose so I'm just gonna flip myself because I have I'm doing the screen recording right here so guys uh, as you can just see I don't think you can see because it's not focusing up but i'm just gonna go ahead and just do the editing here because i will be up i'm just gonna move towards here because i have to please so here i have is my screen it's basically
really like my mood where I turn it on. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just open the VN. Okay. So after opening that, I just go ahead and open the VN. So after that, I just do one thing, which is go just ignore these videos because I was editing these. So just have those random lying there. So then just gonna click on that add button. Then this new project. And then you're just gonna select the one. So this one is the edited one, and this one is like that one. So just gonna select those. Okay. So guys, I did like uh, recording and all stuff, but I just forgot that uh, that recording. It is a long recording it is going to be so i just forgot that i had to create one so now i'm just going to go to that so i use this app for recording it's really really good like this is like the recorded and it's basically for i guess iphone and all that but it's really really good because it helps me a lot because i don't think like these uh these phones have like the screen recording in them so yeah so just do that and it i basically like the feature that you can just start the broadcasting and the microphone is off so my voice will not be of course be heard by you guys so it's capturing i think so no yeah it started as you can just see it's a good thing that when it starts like recording you can just see that there is like the time it shows then i'm just gonna go ahead and open this file just gonna like hold it for a second and just gonna do So then just gonna stop the broadcast and then again gonna do these broadcasts because I have to show you guys of course so I just gonna go here and just I just click on that my uh, recordings option that is at the bottom and then you can just go ahead and select the one which you want like I just selected this and you just have to click on that share button and then it just prepares the video for you and then just ignore the ad as I as the net is torn on that's why I just pops up of nowhere so then just gotta go ahead and save it to camera roll video saved successfully so then after that you just gotta go ahead and open VN oh I forgot to again turn on the screen recording it's gonna be a huge hassle for me because I'm not used to like rec screen record like and do the editing and stuff and I'm filming also and recording also so it's a huge task for me so it started recording okay yeah it started so then just gotta go ahead and open the vn as you can see i have already added the clip so what i do is just click on that music option which is right there yeah and just click on that music and then just click on that extract from video because we are doing and it's so good that you don't have to watch ads while extracting this because in BLLO which I used to do edit you had to watch like the uh, an ad for like extracting video and all that stuff so it's a good thing and you just gotta select that video and I just write here I just will write this one because I don't know the song actually it's like um tum tum or something song I think I will just write that because otherwise it's gonna make me confused like just writing transition over there so then I just gotta go ahead and save it in insta because uh YT means the music which I use for my vlogs and all that like meanwhile and YT Instagram which means just okay okay so we're just gonna use this tum tum song which I don't know if it is the name or not so I'm just gonna use it then what I gotta do is just gonna crop this to where the music starts. So this was a famous like a uh, uh, Instagram like dance a long while ago. I don't know if it's still trending or not because I haven't done it. So I just see. The video is matching i don't know if it's recording or not because yeah i guess it's recording i just hope that it's recording because okay my facial expression is not okay 
I don't think I didn't do any better in that so yeah so we're just gonna leave it in that flying position where I just am flying it so so then I'm just gonna delete this portion because I don't need that and then I'm just gonna grab here and just see where I have done the same thing and then I'm just gonna crop it and then I'm just gonna fix the frame because I guess frame is not fixed so. I don't think that is smooth enough. No. Okay, so just gonna switch it. Okay. So just have to match that. Okay, I guess so. Yeah, that is a good transition. Just like I mean, like I just like to do it like uh a very basic one but it looks cute and editing on this phone so then just gonna check i think the switch is still not matching it okay yeah i don't know why but vn when editing like it just adds this directed by input title like this i don't know why they just add it because it's literally useless like no one's gonna have it and it's good that it doesn't have any watermark and all that because this one exports your video in a very high quality as well as it doesn't have any watermark so like for the past i think month it has been my favorite one because vllo you can't just uh use some of the features because it doesn't allow and this one also allows you to i think i think that pin or something peep i think peep, yeah you can pick image or video on another video without need without you need to buy an app like premium pack and i think that premium pack is basically for more effects filters more text like uh things that you need so yeah so then what i do is just select spring. I just you like to use like this black frame like in the starting because it makes like like it has been it's just my way of doing that so just ignore that so then like that I just stop it then just stop where my hand is because I just like to do like a transition like that so I just gonna do is move it like that I'm going to add this black thing inside middle. So it's quite speed. So for the speed adjustment, I really like that it has like two options, which is the curve and regular. So you can basically use the curve one, which means you can just basically slow speed the video wherever you want. And regular, which means the whole video will be in the same pace, like up to the clip, how much you have the clip. So as it is pretty speed, I'm just going to go ahead and make it a bit slow. Like... I'm gonna make it more slow because it looks like it so fast. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. So like that. And then I'm gonna stop where I smile because I have smiled as well. So I'm gonna do like I like small small transition parts and all that. So I'm just gonna do this. So I think it's I decided to make it a bit more slow. Yeah. Then I just thought that it's too short, like it's 6.47, like 6.4 four seven seconds so i'm just gonna add some photo clips which i have okay because why not yeah some of the clicks like i just clicked yesterday okay i think that's pretty good so i'm just gonna make it like small small like clips so i'm just gonna cut it like i'm making this really really small it's like 0 0.2329 like that so small small second i'm even adding this like a fraction of time because if i just want to do like small like uh i'm gonna crop most of the part because i can just check it yeah so it was too big so i'm just gonna extend it up to 2.5 let's see okay so i'm just gonna do the same thing for each and every clip because i need some like 0 0.18 like it's too short like it just goes in a blink of an eye so i'm just gonna shift it to 2.5 each of these ones yeah 
Unless you know one is when they're too bad for you. So it doesn't matter. So I think this one is too much. Yeah, that one looks okay. I think this one. I'll just make this one instead. Crop it. Okay. So I'm just gonna see. I'm just gonna add that this. Can't add the blue. Yeah. I think it's too short. I think I don't need to add. I think the video duration is too short. So let's see what it is. So I'm just gonna see from the first. Like I just zoom it in with the bigger frame and just use it and see it. So I guess I shouldn't add this thing here because it looks I'm just gonna remove this one. I don't know why. I guess that one was good. So then what I do is just click on that, um, what I would say, like this and a uh, arrow button. I'm just going to go ahead and save it. And the estimated file size is 135.91 MB. So as you can see, you can just uh, like check the resolution, which is 4K FPS, which is 6 and the average width rate I just use it maximum most of my reels and videos I do it in 150 because it's like the best video quality you can get so then I just export it um then it just export as it's like a few seconds seven seconds like that video so it doesn't take that much time if you're editing like a video like normal vlogs and all that it takes like a whole 15 to 20 minutes for just exporting and editing it takes like one and a half hour like that so then what you gotta do is just click on save to album and the one thing which i really really love about this is you can just go and project you can just see even if you by mistakenly deleted this video from your uh, gallery as well as recycle bean and you have it in your projects like you haven't edited it you just have added and kept it there it still is there like it will not get deleted you can just edit it like normal so that's like the best thing of it so um I'm done, I guess. Yeah. So, where is Instagram? Yeah, here it is. So, this. So, I just like, uh, you like also record the music because sometimes, like, uh, what happens, like, while a transition reels, like, sometimes they remove that music, and if the transition music is moved, I really hate it. So, then without music, also, I cannot edit it. So, I just like screen record that, uh, Pretty, uh, like that sound and then just use it and just click on it add a button then reel uh, start new video uh, ignore my face it looks like freaking like I'm just doing like this so okay just ignore that just I'm not okay so then I'm gonna click on this black screen okay I, that looks good so then I'm just gonna go and click next so, um, so about like this, the this one was the dance video, and this one was like that edit one day, and I just added it because it was so good. I really liked it. Like the sound was different. gonna refresh my screen because most of them doesn't get refreshed um is the netflix or what no idea so here's the video yeah so we're gonna stop that screen recording because i guess the screen recording was really really large i don't know if it did record the whole thing or not 
yeah it did it did it did it did oh so we're good it's just a video saved successfully okay Any other? yeah so i guess you guys enjoyed this video because this was one of the requested videos that you guys did so i guess you enjoyed it and i had to sh like it's really simple because editing videos is basically how you want people to like enjoy your video and i just like to first of all i just want to make sure that i like my video myself and then i just go ahead and edit it like the way i want the um, slow speed motions and all that and just like the effects and all that and it's pretty much done like it's pretty simple so i guess that you guys enjoy this video if you enjoyed this video then make sure to give this video a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel and uh, make sure to comment down below if you have any request which i will make sure to do in my next video so guys thank you so much for watching and bye bye